whispering strip been doing really well in the in this enclosure but they're getting really active now they're climbing they're fighting they're playing and they're really ready for the next part of their development which is going outside into the release enclosure Whisper I got her very young so she's really still quite connected to me but having Stuart in here is going to be her key to rewilding so uh, after today we're going to be pretty hands off with her uh, but you can see she's still looking at me as a parent figure and we've got to change that we've got to get her now thinking more stoat and less human so moving them is quite tricky I'm not sure how I'm going to do it yet I've got the sleeping bag in there and I've also got a, a box for them so we've got to catch them one way or another Stuart's uh, gone to hiding underneath the old carpet at the bottom of the enclosure but I think Whisper's going to be a really easy one to get but uh, Stuart's going to be a lot trickier so we're just going to catch them up now, gather them up and get them outside. There we go, we've got Whisper, that was a very easy catch so she can just go in the box now. And now I've got to catch a Stuart. This is going to be the trickier one, uh, hidden underneath the carpet. That's it, we've got Stuart in a sleeping bag now, which is ideal, so I don't need to touch Stuart because uh, I think Stuart would bite me by this stage because it hasn't been uh, handled much at all recently. So uh, yeah, so we're just going to pop them in the sleeping bag together. Just pop Whisper in there as well. There we go. I've got both stoats in the bag now, I'm just going to take them out to the uh, new enclosure. This is where I'll be living for the next few weeks, outside in this really large enclosure. And it's got a double door on it, so they can't uh, escape when I'm getting in, because they're very fast uh, little creatures. So I'm just going to pop them in there now. So I'm going to put the stoats into the nest here, but they've got loads of places to explore here. We've got a dry stone wall here at the back. We've got old branches that they can climb up. Well, this is going to be the important area for them. There's going to be a nest in here. Uh, and I'm going to put the hat in because it's important to take this from the old enclosure to the new one. We've got a little nose poking out of here now, so they want to be out. So I'm going to put them in the nest and uh, they're going to have a lot more space to play. So this nest is going to be a really important area for them. This is going to be their main area to rest and sleep. So I'm just going to put them in there in the sleeping bag and uh, we'll then leave them to it. There we go, that's going to be their new uh, nest for a while there. So that's them safely in the nest, so I'm going to pop the lid back down. This is the next part of their adventure and we're watching them really closely because we've got hidden cameras in here so we'll be able to see how they get on. <laughs> 